What's up guys, my name is Devin, also known as FBE, and welcome back to another episode of Footballers. In today's video, we're gonna be bringing you guys another episode of the What Players Wear on the Field series. And today we're gonna to be talking about George Pickens, wide receiver, Pittsburgh Steelers. Huge shout out to all the people that commented George Pickens. If you guys wanna see your favorite player featured on this series, comment them below or find somebody that already commented that name and like their comment to bring it to the top. And just in case you guys are new to the series, what we do is we take a player. For this episode, it's going to be GP. We talk about their gear, head to toe, helmets, cleats, gloves, shoulder beds, you name it, we're going to talk about it in today's video. Stay tuned till the end of the video to see a sneak preview of some cleats George Pickens is going to wear next week. Without further ado, let's get into the video. We're going to start things off up top. For his helmet this year, George Pickens has been in the Riddell Speedflex. You guys know all about this lid. We talk about it constantly on this channel, so I'm not going to waste too much time on it. But this is a five-star rated football helmet, the most popular helmet in all of football. It has this incredible balance of modern looks and then also some of the best safety ratings on the planet. If you guys want to grab one for yourself, Green Gridiron has them on sale right now for 500 bucks. Next key piece to this helmet setup is going to be his custom custom face mask. This mask right here is the Beck 808 EG face mask. Basically what that code means is that this mask has two sets of jagged eye guards originally inspired by the OG OBJ mask. And then the 808 lower style is inspired by Marcus Mariota's custom face mask. And then lastly, the EG stands for the extra set of jagged eye guards. This right here is just one of the coolest face masks in all of the game and definitely one of my favorites. And if you guys want to get this exact mask, BA Masks has them for 325 bucks linked in the description below. And just something to keep in mind as you guys watch this video, every single product we talk about will be linked in the description below so you guys can directly shop George Pickens' locker. Next up is the visor. All season long, George Pickens has been wearing a clear Oakley Pro visor. As you guys probably know by now, the Pro Plastic is designed to fit the Speedflex face mask absolutely flawlessly. And visors are just an easy and simple upgrade to upgrade your swag and also give you a little bit of added eye protection. And if you guys want to grab this visor for yourself, it's 76 bucks from our good friends over at Green Gridiron. Next up, we've got an iconic piece from George Pickens' game day look. That's going to be his shy mask. Now the specific one he rolls with is the new era cold weather balaclava. Now obviously it is going to keep you a little bit warmer if you decide to wear this, but I'm pretty sure he just wears this for the look. Insert draft day meme. Either way, if you want this exact same shicey, the Steeler shop actually sells it for 30 bucks, so check it out, link below. Next thing we got to talk about is mouth guards, and we've seen George Pickens wear a whole bunch of different VEDEX mouth guards. This season we've seen him rock pink, black, green, blue, and purple. These mouth guards are relatively inexpensive, and as George Pickens has showed us, they come in a whole bunch of different colors. Honestly, make you wonder if the NFL has any rules on different colored mouth guards. Either way, if you guys want one, they're like 10 bucks on Amazon, go check it out. The final piece of this helmet setup is going to be his chin strap sleeve. He wears it in all white, but unfortunately I can't really find the exact brand. We've talked about the Dry Max ones in the past on this series, but this doesn't look like one of theirs. Either way, I can't figure out exactly what brand this one is, but you can get a Dry Max one at their website. Either way, if you guys do want a high quality chin sleeve, I do recommend Dry Max. They make some of the best in the business and they are linked in the description below for you guys. Next thing we're going to talk about is shoulder pads. George Pickens is rolling with the X-Tech X2 shoulder pads. Now these are a super popular option in the NFL because they're both lightweight and also offer plenty of protection. They also give wide receivers like Pickens plenty of mobility so they can reach all over the place to catch the football. He's also rocking the X-Tech rectangular backplate as well to help protect that lower back. And if you want to grab a pair of X-Techs, head on over to their website and build yourself a pair. Now we're down to some arm accessories. This season we've seen George Pickens wear the Nike Hyper Warm Arm Sleeve in both white and yellow. Some games this season Pickens would roll with the double arm sleeves and then some other games he would just roll with one. Unfortunately, if you guys want to get some for yourself, these sleeves are extremely extremely hard to find. I think Nike stopped making them, so hopefully they bring them back sometime soon because people love these sleeves. But I do recommend you head on over to eBay and maybe you'll find yourself a set there. Up next, we got to talk about one of the most important accessories when talking about wide receivers, gloves. And we've seen Pickens wear five different pairs this season, so buckle in. This is going to be a long section. The first pair we're going to talk about and the pair he's worn the most is the Nike Vaporknit 3.0. He's worn these in a white and black colorway and then a white and yellow colorway as well. These gloves dropped back in 2019 as Nike's high tier receiver glove. The back of hand is built with a lightweight fly knit material and then of course the palm has nike super tacky magna grip overall these gloves are getting a little bit old but still some of the better gloves on the market and just like the arm sleeves you guys want a pair of these head on over to ebay and try your luck there the next pair of gloves is a pair he only wore in a chilly pregame the nike vaporjet 5.0 cold weather as you guys can probably guess by the name, these are built for the cold weather. These have a fleece liner, a winterized outer material, and they appear to have hydro grip palms. Unfortunately, these are only offered to the NFL and college guys as of right now, so us general public people just can't get our hands on them. But again, I'd try your luck over on eBay. eBay's got all sorts of stuff. The next pair is a pair he only wore for a very brief moment of time, but you guys know us. We try to cover absolutely everything, and that's going to be a pair of Nike Vaporjet 6.0s. This pair was the Steelers team-issued pair, so it was white and yellow, and then it had the Steelers logo on the front. The Vaporjet 6 was one of my favorite models back when they dropped in 2020. They have a nice tight back of hand and then Magna Grip Plus bombs, which are a little bit stickier than the OG Magna Grip. These gloves are coming up on three years, so they aren't really in stores anymore. Check eBay. If you guys didn't know about the magic of eBay before, now you do. The next pair we're going to talk about is another pair he's worn a ton this season, the Nike Super Red 5.0. 
He's mostly worn them in an icy all white colorway, but also pulled out some black and yellow and then an all yellow pair as well. These are honestly kind of a weird choice for a wide receiver because the super bad is typically a big skill glove because it has a padded back of hand. Usually you see wide receivers go with something a little bit more lightweight, but George Pickens is not your run of the mill wide out. Honestly, Pickens just wears whatever he wants. So it's uh, it's kind of fitting. And again, if you guys want to grab some of these, check eBay. They did release a little bit ago. The final pair of gloves he's worn so far this season through 11 weeks is the Nike Super Red 6.0s in a white and black colorway. Now we only wore these for a little bit, but these are the most modern gloves he's worn so far this season. The Super Red 6 originally dropped back in 2021. And as of right now, it is still the most recent Super Red. They are releasing the seven, I think in February or May of 2024. But just like the Super Red 5, these are a padded back of hand glove with Madiger Plus palms. Now, if you want a pair of these, you don't have to go to eBay. Dick Sporting Goods still has them on their website for 60 bucks. Now, finally, it's time to talk about cleats. Pickens has worn four different pairs of cleats so far this season. And then we have a bonus pair that he hasn't worn yet, but he'll wear them sometime this season. Now, probably the coolest pair of the bunch is his Bapes to Customs. Now, he's worn these a lot this season. They are probably some of the coolest cleats we've seen all season from any player. These are a total reconstruction by at Coda Customs. And the base cleat is the Nike Vapor Untouchable Speed 3. And that actually brings me to the next pair on this list, the Nike Vapor Untouchable Speed 3. Now these ones aren't custom. These are just a regular pair of white and gray Nike Vapor Untouchable Speed 3s. Throughout this video, you guys have seen Pickens just kind of wears anything, but a lot of the stuff he's been wearing is pretty old and these kind of follow that trend. These dropped back in 2018. They're low cut, lightweight, and just a pure speed cleat. Sometimes Pickens wears them spatted, sometimes not kind of weird, but these definitely seem to be his favorite go-to cleat. If you guys want a pair of these, you guys can head on over to eBay or hit up some of the cleat resellers like FB cleat underscore heat or college FB gear. The next pair is a pair he only wore for one week, the Nike Vapor Untouchable Pro 1. Now he wore these in a custom painted yellow color and I'm pretty sure they have his number 14 on the toe box. These are another older pair. These dropped back in 2016, but you still see them on the gridiron from time to time in the NFL. These are one of the last cleats from Nike with the iconic carbon fiber traction plate, which makes them extremely sought after. Overall, these are a sweet skill cleat, but getting harder and harder to find. Like most things in this video, head on over to eBay or check out some of the cleat resellers. The next pair on this list is a pair of Nike Vapor Carbon Elite 2014s that he only wore for one week. I could only find one photo of him in the cleats, but he did indeed wear them. Now these right here are arguably the most iconic cleat from the golden era of Nike football. They are one of the best looking silhouettes of all time, have the carbon fiber traction plate and just one of the coolest cleats you could roll up in. Pickens has them in the OG black colorway with the Volt accents. These are iconic, I love these cleats. These cleats dropped almost 10 years ago, so finding them is pretty impossible. And then when you do, they cost a pretty penny. I've seen these cleats go for well over a thousand dollars. So good luck finding these. Go on eBay, check out the cleat resellers, Hopefully you can find a pair and you don't have to pay too much. Now the final pair of cleats in this video is a pair of cleats he technically hasn't even worn yet. So this is a little bit of a sneak preview of what's to come for George Pickens. And that's going to be these Jordan 8 Customs. As you guys can probably guess, these are another total reconstruction by Coda Customs. The base cleat is the Nike Vapor Untouchable Speed 3, which we talked about earlier. And these cleats look incredible. The cleat is mostly red with some nice yellow accents. And yes, red technically isn't really in the Steelers uniform, but if you guys look closely at the logo, there is that little red diamond, so it works. But these cleats are absolutely nuts. I can't wait to see him pull these out next week. There you guys have it. There's George Pickens game day gear, head to toe. This guy wears a whole bunch of gear, cleats, gloves. There was so much of it. This video was a total grind. So please show some love if you guys haven't already. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, like the video, comment who you guys want to see next on this series, and subscribe for more videos just like this one. My name is Evan, also known as FBE, and thank you guys so much for tuning into another episode of Footballers.